So there's a new app in Windows Town that's actually solving a big, big problem. This app is creating a relationship between Windows and the iPhone. Now you must be wondering, iPhones would never allow that. Security, privacy, blah, blah, blah. But you're wrong. I mean, I was expecting Microsoft Windows to solve this whole iPhone and Windows problem, but it's actually Intel, which has smartly solved this with the new Intel Unison app. Now I'll tell you everything about this new app and trust me, the more you'll know, the more you'll like it. But let me start with my favorite feature, the ability to share files between Windows and iPhone. I mean, there's no airdrop on Windows and iPhone users just use third-party apps to transfer files, which is not at all convenient. With Unison, you can just drag and drop a file here and it will arrive on your iPhone. Seamless. Same goes the other way. You can just select a file on your iPhone and transfer it to your PC. Yeah, it just works. And the cool thing is if you want to see the photos on your iPhone, on your Windows PC, the Unison app syncs up the gallery as well, so you can do that. I mean, this is the gallery and just like on the iPhone, the photos are categorized by months and years. There's also photos, videos and albums and you can adjust the thumbnail size. So you get a lot of control and I can just open up a photo and you see all these options here like download, save as, share. And if you delete a photo here, it gets deleted on the iPhone too. It's just that you'll have to confirm it. Honestly, this gallery tab is super useful because say you want to quickly share a screenshot from your iPhone to PC. Now you can just take a screenshot and it will show up here in unison. Yeah, this is useful and if you're finding this video useful, make sure to subscribe because that'd be great. Anyway, you can even upload photos from your PC to iPhone with this button. So file transfer is obviously a big pain between the iPhone and a Windows PC and this Unison app solves that. But you know what? This app also brings notifications from your iPhone to your Windows PC. See, whatever messages, notifications from your apps, your phone receives, you get them on Windows thanks to this app. You can see all your notifications in the Unison app or you can see them in the Windows Notification Center. It's great. I also like that I can set the notifications to not show detail for better privacy. Now, there is one little downside. The notifications aren't actionable. So when you get a message, you cannot reply to it directly, but at least you're getting your iPhone's notifications on your PC. And the good thing is, notifications arrive as they arrive on your iPhone. There's no delay. Plus, you can message people from the Messages tab in the Unison app. You can message someone and the replies also show up just fine. So it's pretty good. And if you're messaging someone on iPhone, this automatically uses iMessage. You don't have to set anything up. Now, considering this is the first release, this is really good. You also get notified when you get calls on your iPhone and you can accept calls and talk to people using your laptop's mic and speaker. You also get all the controls like the mute option or the dialer. And if you want to make a call from your PC, you can obviously do that. The calls tab in the app has all the contacts and you can call them from here or even from the messages page. Here at the top, there is a call option. Look, all this is great, but the best thing about Unison is that even though this is the first release of the app, everything just works like it's supposed to. There are no bugs, no errors, nothing. Even the setup process is really easy. You just install the app on Windows and you install the app on iPhone, give it the permissions, scan the QR code and it's done. It's also a very lightweight app. Most of the time when we're using it, Unison took around just 2% of the CPU usage and around 530, 540 MB of RAM while running, so pretty good. Also, what's really cool is that Intel Unison is supposed to work with 12th gen Intel Evo certified laptops only, but I've been showing it to you on an 11th gen non-Evo Intel laptop and it works flawlessly. I mean, we even tried it on an AMD laptop and it worked flawlessly. So basically, this right now works on everything. Honestly, I just hope that this is a bug Intel never fixes. Just to make it clear, Intel Unison also works with Android phones, obviously. But if you are an Android user, I think you should stick to using Phone Link because it just has more features. I mean, there are features like clipboard sync, you can mirror your phone, use apps from your phone with some phones. Yeah, these are the features that Unison is missing, but for iPhone users who use a Windows laptop, maybe for gaming or just for the flexibility of the hardware, I think Unison is a super useful app. So share this video with iPhone users who don't have a Mac.